guys welcome and welcome back to my channel so this is gonna be an impromptu lock update i didn't have this planned out at all but um i figured a few things have changed and not huge things but just a few things nonetheless and again they were kind of spur of the moment like this video is for the moment and uh yeah so let's just get into it first as you guys can see i interlocked them again today actually not today last night i interlocked them so fresh fresh interlock i'll show you guys side and the back Yeah, so they've grown a little bit. And if y'all happen to see a little bit of white on the ends of some of them, like on the very, like maybe that one a little bit, those are the ones I cut. Some of them have a little bit of like lint or buildup or whatever. And it's not even because I use products. I honestly, I actually don't use products at all. Like I only interlock. Um, I don't use any kind of like locking gel aside from like, the little bit of gel I use on my on my edges but like on the actual locks I've never used anything like that but um just a side note or just a as I said general disclaimer um locks tend to get build up even even if you don't use like products um like twisting gels and stuff like that or locking gels uh so yeah that's the case with me I don't use anything like that but um your hair produces or your scalp rather produces sebum and um dead skin cells all kinds of stuff so over time those can and will get wrapped up in your lock it's just it's just part of having locks but um so if y'all see any of that in some of the ones that i trim that's why um like that one yeah that that's one of them and you know I'll try to like pick some of it out. But anyway, so this is what they look like now that I've trimmed them. I didn't keep the, you know, the ends that I trimmed off. It wasn't even a lot, honestly. That's why I didn't keep it. Like I literally just did it this morning. It wasn't planned out or anything like that. It was just, I was looking at them and I didn't like how uneven they were looking like after I interlocked it. And after you interlock it, you can really see how, um, how much one how much more growth you've gotten and then two once you see that you can kind of see better like the different lengths of your hair because of course our hair grows at different at different rates throughout our heads so um but i didn't like that so much so i just i just grabbed the scissors and i i'm no stranger to scissors <laughs> and cutting my hair so um yeah i just trimmed the ones that um, I felt needed it. So let me try to get a little bit closer. So yeah, these, I didn't trim all of them, mainly the bottom like row, like towards the back of my head, like that layer. Um, I didn't even bluntly like cut it as y'all can see. It kind of looks a little bit blunt, but um, that's really just because I kind of just, grabbed the ones that were way longer and just trimmed them trimmed them up to the length almost as the other ones but not too perfectly because obviously i as i said i don't want it or i didn't want it to be like super blunt and everything look like the same exact length but i wanted them to be closer in length so as y'all could see it's still you know it's kind of like giving that shape and they're not all the same length. They're never going to be the same length because, as I said, our hair doesn't grow at the same length, which totally fine. Like, I don't I don't mind that at all. Um, but I didn't want one, like, damn near down to my nipple and then the next one is, like, up here, you know? So 
um, I got rid of those. <laughs> I had like a couple of them like that or a few of them like that. And I just kind of trimmed them up. So um, I could feel that one was one that I trimmed. That one too. Because as I said, I just handpicked them out and just snipped. And then of course, some of the blunted ones on this side. This one I trimmed. This one I definitely trimmed. Yeah, so that's what I did. <laughs> that's what I did. And I decided to do it now after I just interlocked so that everything is kind of laid down and like weighed down, laid down and weighed down <laughs> basically from the interlocking. So, um, so I could get like a good idea of how it's going to lay and how it's going to like drop basically. So, um, I'm sitting in front of the window y'all, <laughs> which is why I'm like, keep looking that way because I live on a main street. So there's just people and cars and everything. Anyway, um, so yeah, that's pretty much what I did. And then I just decided also on a whim to do my edges. Y'all know these days I have not been doing my edges like at all, but this today I decided I wanted to do them and, um, it came out cute. So, um, yeah, that was it. And, uh, even my makeup, like I, y'all know, again, I don't really wear a ton of makeup anyway or makeup frequently. Maybe y'all don't know because it's not like y'all see me like on a daily basis, <laughs> but um, day to day, I'm usually like zero makeup. But um, again, my locks were done and I felt like doing a little extra to look a little cute. So um, these ashy knuckles ain't cute though, but it's all good. It's because like, I wash my hands like a gazillion times a day and I have, I'm a fucking mom. I'm washing my hands constantly. So, um, yeah, it is what it is. Anyway, that's all I pretty much wanted to show you guys. Um, the fact that they have grown a bit, but then I trimmed them <laughs> this morning. So I guess I took away the little bit of growth that happened, but, um, honestly, I, that doesn't bother me. So yeah, that is it. That's all I really wanted to show y'all was what my hair is looking like now and um, where it's at. Still very low maintenance. I don't do hardly anything to it outside of washing it and interlocking it. I just washed it actually um, the day before yesterday and then I interlocked it yesterday, last night. So um, yeah, I, I don't do anything else <laughs> to my hair. So not a huge update outside of just that they're growing but I trim them and I will probably continue to trim them like as they grow out um if they grow out or not if but when they grow out and the stragglers come back I'll just keep trimming them I personally don't intend on letting them grow like super long or anything like that long enough this is fine I'm good with where they're at then enjoying them and yeah so that is that. <laughs> Not anything super long or crazy. I just wanted to update you guys on how my locks are doing, how I'm doing. Not that I spoke much about myself, but I'm doing all right too. Thanks for asking. <sighs> yeah, so that's that. Um, if you guys like this video, y'all already know, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you want to see more. Leave comments, do all the things, and I will see y'all in the next one. Thank you.